Hello guys, it's Johnny Tam and welcome to another decentralized finance tutorial. Today, we are going to learn how to use SushiSwap from your iPhone. If you have Android phone, it's the exactly the same, so it will work the same way. So watch this video to learn how to do it, how to start using your mobile phone, swapping tokens, maybe staking tokens in SushiSwap in different blockchains, Ethereum, Binance Smart and Polygon and much more so watch this video till the end to learn how to do it but first subscribe to my channel and click the bell notification button so any time i post this kind of educational tutorials about DeFi, about crypto about decentralization you can watch them as soon as possible now let's get into business and the first thing that you want to do is to take your iphone and open your app store now search for metamask wallet if you're not familiar with what metamask is it's basically a decentralized wallet that lets you hold cryptocurrencies on various different of blockchains and interact with uh, decentralized apps like SushiSwap, Uniswap, PancakeSwap, etc, etc. So we're going to download Metamask on our mobile phone. This is the exact same wallet that you have on your computer, on your browser, the same extension that you have. Uh, so it's you can actually import the same wallet that you have on your browser. You can export the uh, seed phrase or the private key and then import it in your phone or maybe you can create a new wallet. So you can see right now that MetaMask has been uh, downloaded and now we have this kind of Fox icon application. I'm going to click open right here and then the MetaMask will be opened on my iPhone. So this is the get started screen, super, super straightforward. I will just click get started. Now you have three different options. So the first one is import using secret uh, recovery phrase. Let's say you have a browser extension with MetaMask installed and you have already tokens in this kind of wallet. Maybe it's on Ethereum blockchain, maybe Binance Smart Chain, maybe Polygon, and you want to use the same wallet here in your mobile device, you can do it. You can use the same wallet from the extension and then from the wallet by using the import using secret recovery phrase. They have a new feature that I haven't tried, which is sync with MetaMask extension. I guess that when you connect the phone to the computer, there is some kind of way that the MetaMask extension is sharing the private key with a mobile application, but they never use it because, so I cannot tell you if it works and how good it is. And also you can create a brand new wallet. So you can ask MetaMask to create a new wallet. And this is what we're gonna do right now in this extension. And we'll create a new MetaMask wallet. Now, no thanks. Now we will choose a password. This password will be used to lock your, lock your MetaMask wallet. So every time you open the app, the, the wallet will not be available, but we have a, you will have to put the password. So if someone steals your phone, it will not be able to steal your all your funds. So remember this password so you can access your funds and also do not share it with anyone. All right, guys, now that you have chosen your password, you take you tick this can and understand that MetaMask cannot recover this password for me. You tick this checkbox and then create, create password. Now it creates a brand new wallet for you. Now it shows you how to back up your secret recovery first. This is super, super important. This is your 12 words that if someone has access to them, you can steal all your funds and get complete access to your wallet. And also if you lose your phone or something happened to your phone, this is the words that you will use in order to back up and restore your wallet. So make sure to keep it in a safe place. And now I'm gonna just take a screenshot because I don't mind it's a temporary wallet that I'm not gonna use anyways. Uh, but you do not do it. Do not take a screenshot and save it on your phone. And then you have to verify that actually you know the words, right? So you know the, the, the words. And now once you completed and filled all the words and MetaMask actually verified that you backed up your words because they want to make sure that you can recover your wallet if something happens, you click here, complete backup. And congratulations, guys, you have a new MetaMask wallet. As I said, you can also import the same wallet that you have in your browser, but now you have the MetaMask wallet in your mobile application and we can use this wallet in order to use you sushi swap and swap tokens and buy and sell tokens so here you can see the account and the wallet that you have you can receive buy and send tokens if you have now i'm on the ethereum chain you can see on the top right here that i'm connected to the ethereum blockchain you can connect to other blockchains as well but let's do this example with ethereum blockchain and you can see all your tokens and all your different nfts that you have in your wallet you can send wallet you can click on ether and then send ether you can also uh, receive ether this is your qr code and your wallet address so you can give it to people to send you some ether and the more important thing now is how do i actually use uh, sushi swap. So in order to use sushi swap, you're gonna open up this left side menu and then gonna open browser. We need to browse to sushi swap within the MetaMask application because 
Actually, through the MetaMask, the browser can interact with web 3.0 applications. If you use Safari or Chrome in your iPhone, it will not work because the MetaMask app itself connects to the web 3.0 application. This is known as application SushiSwap through the inside browser. So you have to, to use you have to use the browser within the uh, MetaMask application. Now you're gonna search for SushiSwap. And you should be very careful when you search on Google, but there are so many scams out there. So make sure that you have the right domain, the right address. And actually the first one is the right one. This is DuckDuckGo, so it's quite safe. And you can see that it's sushi.com. This is the legitimate domain, HTTPS. And then you're gonna click enter app. And now the first thing that will happen is that you will see a prompt like you see with your MetaMask extension that Sushi app, Sushi Swap app wants to connect your wallet to the site. I'm going to click here, connect. And now guys, congratulations, your brand new wallet, your MetaMask wallet is connected for your iPhone. Now you can use Sushi Swap to swap tokens, for example. Let's say I want to swap one Ether to uh, USDC. To, uh, yeah, to USDC, so you can, now I don't have any ETH, but if I would have ETH, I would see a swap button, and then when I, once I click swap, I will have a pop-up on my application to confirm the swap, and it will be the exact same thing like you have in your desktop application, in your browser, in the extension. So this is super, super cool, and by the way, SushiSwap supports multiple blockchains, so if you want, you can change. So as you can see, we saw how we can swap tokens, but you can actually use SushiSwap to stake some tokens. You have some amazing farms, you know, these kind of super high yields. Of course, these tokens might not be that stable. So you should be careful once you buy those tokens and stake them. You need to read about the projects and not just buy because you see high APRs. But actually now, through my iPhone, I can perform swaps on SushiSwap. I can add liquidity. I can stake tokens on farms. Everything that you can do from your browser itself. So I find it super, super easy, super, super convenient to use this kind of MetaMask mobile iPhone application. And I hope this guide was helpful for you. And now you can uh, start swapping and trading and do cool DeFi stuff from your iPhone. Let me know if you have any questions and if you like this content, subscribe, smash the like button so you can get updated anytime I post these kind of amazing videos that you can learn from them. Thank you so much for watching my videos and learning with me right here and I will see you in the next guide. Bye-bye.